we rehearsed a little bit in uh, Hammersmith and on the way back on the tube yesterday the train stopped in the middle in between the stations you see <clears throat> the only thing that we didn't rehearse with the stories and that is actually the wrong story Thank you, Phil. This one actually concerns a collector, a man by the name of Saplock, who used to collect everything that he had in his life, uh, bus tickets, paper bags, all sorts. So his room was full of junk, and every time he got more and more stuff, he had to build his house a little bit bigger and bigger and bigger. Eventually, disaster struck when his dog, Ronaldo, died. So he took Ronaldo to the place where all dead dogs should go, to the taxidermist. And Ronaldo was back in his room within a week. And he sat first of all on his chair, but he didn't look quite right there, didn't look very comfortable. Then he tried him by the fireplace where he usually sat, and then he lifted him up in his full glory and stood him on the table. And just then, the glass eyes began to wink a little, and some sign of life returned to the dog, and his tail wagged. And as that happened, the table began sprouting branches and leaves. And everything started moving backwards into life, and the coal moved into sort of compressed gunge. And, and there was a, a strange rug just in front of the car. Fire. Made out of lamb's wool. And the rug slowly returned to life, and there was a little... Lamb. As the neon still to the 
Yeah. <laughs>